forefront. Fox 5's Christian De La Rosa is here with the first Bitcoin ATM. Explain, Christian. Yeah, it's the first in the world, and it basically would make it easier for you to buy and sell Bitcoins, and it may be just a couple of months before we start seeing them popping up all over San Diego. Bitcoin could most easily be described as the digital equivalent of cash. It's an online currency you can use to shop online at a growing number of websites. There's a lot of eateries, a lot of cafes. You can even buy pizza with it. Thursday, it traded at $100 per Bitcoin in the stock market. You can buy Bitcoins online, but there's no bank involved, no third party. Everything is peer-to-peer. Anybody from any walk of life and any age um, can buy Bitcoins and hold them as a, a play on the technology market. Now, the world's first ever Bitcoin ATM could soon start operating in San Diego. So you press here. By scanning a QR code, the ATM recognizes your account. You can then buy Bitcoins or cash them out. But while popularity around the online currency continues to grow... You are your own bank. Many are also asking questions like, who invented it? And since there's no bank, who do you go to if you have an issue with your account? Nobody really knows. Bitcoin accounts are also known to be vulnerable to internet hackers. Bitcoin can be as secure or as insecure as you want it to be. Primarily, if you hold all of your coins on your computer uh, and you don't back up your wallet, you know, that's a pretty risky venture right there. Now, one of the reasons San Diego could be the first place to hold these ATMs is because the creator of the software is from San Diego, but he says he's already getting interest from investors in cities across UK, China, Japan, and Russia. Sunday, back to you. Yeah, I may be old school, but I kind of like my old, my paper dollars, but I have a feeling they're onto something of the future. Thanks, Christian.